The old buddy Johnny Daniels inviting you to stay tuned now for the next 30, 28 and a half minutes for some real good bluegrass music. And we've got a good talent on here for you today on this show right here. And uh, <clears throat> Wayne Jurrell and Savannah Bluegrass from Savannah, Savannah, Tennessee, of course. They've been on the show three or four times already, and, and boy, they just do just a good job. People call up and said, ran and raving about where the, where in the world you come across those folks. I've known them for a long, long time. Wayne, you go way back. Wayne's a, a original bluegrass boy, played with Bill Monroe for a couple of years, 88 and 89, I believe Wayne said. And Wayne's a songwriter. He'll be doing some songs probably more than likely he already has on some songs that he wrote, and don't want to feel good, good bluegrass stuff. Okay, enough talk for right now. Let's get this one started with an old Reno song that I like very dearly. Don Reno, of course, I idolized the man. He was my hero. I guess will always be. He was one of a kind, buddy, I guarantee you on that. They don't make them like him no more. You want to kick it? I can if you want to. Okay, let's, Dan's going to kick this off. He's going to give you a little Reno taste right here on this talk. Talk of the Town, it's on my latest CD. It goes like this. Now people seem to watch my footsteps as I go by. They shake their heads and say I'm riding high But this thing has done drove me wild And now it's got me down And made me the talk of the town I'll go down to the river And slowly walk around and if my thoughts don't change a lot, I'll jump right in and drown. Or after what you've done to me, I know I've grown to be. The laughing stock, the talk of the town. think this couldn't happen to a guy like me as nightfall finds me heading to your door but you don't seem to want me since a new love you have found and made me the talk of the town I'll go down to the river and slowly walk around and if my thoughts don't change a lot I'll jump right in and drown or after what you've done to me I know I've grown to be the laughing stock the talk of the town the laughing stock the talk of the town Thank you very much. That's mighty kind of you right there. Yeah, when I make that little round about all the, all the uh, people down here at the studio that help us out so much and volunteer their time, I forget about J.R. Myers. He's a good guy and like a wonderful person. We thank the world of you, J.R., and you do a good job, buddy. Thank you so much. Thank you. See, every Saturday when we come down, it's like clockwork. So J.R. Myers, yeah, I've been down here for several years now. We like like J.R. He's a good guy. Uh, so Wayne, if we introduce the band again for the last time, maybe we we'll introduce you before. Okay, we'll we'll introduce them again yeah, here. We'll on the right over there is Emmett Garner, all the way from Savannah, Tennessee. On the bass is Tommy Cox. He's from over at Adamsville, Tennessee. Paula, my daughter here, she's gonna be a singing a little bit of Mule Skinner. I'm Wayne Gerald, and we are part of the Savannah Bluegrass Band. And, 
And let me say that uh, Bernie Sullivan, been a nine-year man over here, at least nine years. Only man that's been with us for about nine years. And my band, Passing Lane Bluegrass, I forget the name of that, but that's my name of my group. Highway 95 in Richmond, Virginia, Passing Lane Bluegrass. Bernie Sullivan right here from Cottontown, Tennessee on the mandolin, that's my boy. And then Dan Smithy back here on the five string banjo from Mount Juliet, Tennessee. And we all congregate here and do this thing for you and we hope that you enjoy what we put out here. If you do, you can call that number 419-3088 and tell us how you like the uh, program and maybe we can do a request for you or something if you like bluegrass music. And we certainly hope you do since you're watching this. Ew, watching this, excuse me. And if you don't, I don't know why you're watching the doggone thing. Anyway, we appreciate the ones that do like it, so what do we got next on this one? Mule Skinner, okay, yeah, that's your daughter, that's Paula. Oh, let's do that one right there, Wayne. Here we go. in for my friends down at Dixon, Tennessee at the Grand Old Hatchery uh, down that way uh, on Main Street in Dixon, Tennessee. Unique little place, not a little, pretty big. It's an old, old building. I mean, ancient, it seems like to me. My goodness. It was a, they call it the Hatchery because it's an old, old uh, hen house. It had chickens and baby chickens and things like that years and years ago. And they shipped them stuff all over everywhere and everything and, and the mail and everything. They tell me, I don't know, I never did, but what a fascinating place that is. They do uh, shoot movies and stuff there. They got uh, they do do these videos, you know, country music videos. People go down and do that. I played one night with Johnny Lee, uh, uh, Looking for Love and all the old places. Uh, Johnny Lee one night down there. Lonzo and Oscar, I played with Lonzo. And, and I, I don't know who are, Ronnie Stone, and I don't know, just a bunch of them go down there. Anyway, it's a nice place to go down to Vance Smith and the Grand Old Hatchery on Main Street in Tennessee. No, we got uh, in Dixon, Tennessee. What's next? 
I've got another up tempo tune here, a little bit of old Slewfoot. Hey oh, Wayne, Slewfoot, who's gonna do that? Yeah, and I want, I want, to, I want to dedicate that to my little buddy who's been out here dancing with his mama, <laughs> and all the little other cowboys and girls out there in the country. A song called Old Slewfoot. <laughs> here we go. <laughs> See, fair track, fair track, coming after me. You better get your rifle before it's too late. The old food put and he's headed for the gate. He's big around the middle and he's brought across the run. Doing 90 miles an hour, taking 30 feet of time. Ain't never been caught and he's never been trained. Some folks say he looks a lot like me. Started raising honey way up in the trees. I cut the trees down, but the honey was gone. Old blue foot John made himself at home. He's big around the middle and he's brought across the road. Doing 90 miles an hour, taking 30 feet of time. Ain't never been caught and he's never been tree. Some folks say he looks a lot like a me. song for sure yeah buddy like to give your times on my program right quick one more time it comes on every sunday night at eight o'clock my show does johnny daniels bluegrass show been on here ten and a half years almost 11 years 263 song uh program segments or whatever you call them uh comes on every sunday night at eight o'clock on mondays you can get us at six o'clock p.m on wednesdays at three o'clock in the afternoon and on a thursday night at 9 30 and for po people that are late night viewers for whatever reason, we work night shift or something, come in, want to sit around thumb on that thing a little bit, and you'll find us on there during the night two or three times during the night, 365 days a year. So there we are. Live exposure there, and uh, wonderful organization Channel 19 is, a wonderful organization. It's been good to me, I know that. I love it. Uh, anyway, how we doing on time? We are getting out pretty good? Or? No, okay. All righty, we're going to go right along with the program and do what? Get old Dixie. Oh, here we go. <laughs> we, this one, we can get to the arm. We listen up along. <laughs> I like this one. Dan Smithy on the five string banjo. Do one of my favorite banjo tunes called Dear Old Dixie. Let her rip.
<laughs> Woo, man, that's the way he picks it right there. Yeah, man, uh, well, I guess we, time-wise, oh, you got that much? Wow, wow. Okay, uh, what we got on this one? Uh, Wheel Just skip Wheel Hoss for the Jambalaya. Okay, and who does that? All right, here we have Tom on the base. He's going to do Jambalaya. Oh, okay. okay. Bring him around. Come right on here, up right here. Right here. Yes, right here. Right here. Right here. Away from Madison, Tennessee, Tom Cox with a little jambalaya. He'll see you, I guess. Goodbye, Joe. Me gotta go. Me on oh my own. Me gotta go pull the P-Row down the bio. My Yvonne, sweetest one, me oh my oh. Son of a gun, we'll have big fun on the bio. A jumbo like crawfish pie, Billy Gumbo. Cause tonight I'm a gonna see my share of me oh. Pick it tart, fill fruit jar, and the gale. Son of a gun, we'll have big fun on the bio. watches the show, especially people in the hospitals and people that are sick and shut in and can't get out and all that to, to see. The lady said, I saw you on TV. And I said, well, you did? She said, when and where were you at? And she said, I was in the hospital. Made my day. I said, oh, yeah, you had that hair all slicked back and everything. Boy, you was looking good. I said, well, now, ain't that something? All right, that's what we like to hear right there. And they said, I really enjoyed it too, man. You got a good show and all that. That makes me feel so blame good, you know. When people call in like that and want to tell you how good they, they enjoyed this show right here. Just clean atmosphere, no junk, no commercials to, to speak of, <coughs> uninterrupted, 20 and a half minutes of good bluegrass music with good musicians. I try so hard to bring in good musicians. On August 3rd, we have a little group out of uh, Jolton, tell you one more time that August 3rd they should be here. Volunteer Bluegrass. And they are a good little outfit, and everybody loved them. They like, they like Wayne and all. They got them right here, so they, they're in for a shock. I think you'll probably see this show we're looking at on uh, Sunday night. We're doing this on Saturday, probably tomorrow night, 8 o'clock, I imagine. I, or maybe next week. Anyway, at this point in time, and this is a late thing because you'll see this a little later, but I th hope everybody had a wonderful Father's Day, okay? To all the fathers out there. Hope everybody have a wonderful one. That's mean that from the heart. So how we standing there, Chris? Okay, we've got five. Time for one more. Where okay, you we'll call on Lourdes again. She's okay. got a beautiful song here, Land okay. Where No Cabins Fall, in the oh, key of G. I love that. And, uh, I love that. Yeah, try that. I love that. 
And thank you for everybody for viewing right now. We've got a couple more minutes left. We'll get uh, our little dancer, Kathy Spiels, up here and do her thing for you. With little Sterling, her little son, whether he'd become a little star on the show here. People call him, won't know what's his name and, where's he, and all that, where you live and all that good stuff. Okay, thanks again for everybody watching the program and hope you'll tune us in again on Sunday night at 8 o'clock. What's it going to be? You, Joe Clark, is it purple? All right, let's do that one. Come on, <coughs> sit down.